All right, guys, this is one of my laps. I'm playing on the controller right now. Hit tunnel drift right here coming up. Watch the smoke on this bad boy. It's hard to see with all the smoke. All right, but um, real quick, guys, I just want to make a uh, picture here. And uh, I'll show you how to do that in a second. So I, I pulled up in the middle of the road because I like that spot right there. Whoops, hold on, guys. Okay, and uh, that's looking good right about there. All right, so let's go. Now you click this icon right down here, race photos. And uh, you, click, you click on the uh, foot icon, the feet icon, and you can walk around the car. Do you want to get the headlights on? I know that. So I'm gonna exit. I'm gonna wait till wait till I see the headlights come on. Cause I did I did turn them on. So I backed up a little bit. Yeah, that's going to be an awesome photo. See, I'm trying to get a photo like from right there. That's going to be an awesome photo. So right on that line too. All right, I need to rewind a little bit. I had to catch it at the right time. I do want that. I do want the. Uh, there we go. Okay, so we paused it right there. Go to the camera. This is gonna be a nice picture. And now we're gonna go over here. I, I do want some of the. Okay, like somewhere right around there. All right, we'll see right about there. Looks good. And I want some of the sky in the composition. I want some of the yellow line in the composition. And I think I'm gonna go right about there. All right, so then you hit X at the bottom. It says, uh, prepare the camera. The first thing I want to do is set my frame. Set my frame, kind of just playing around here. That looks good to me. And maybe give it a little tilt. Uh, maybe back the other way. Yeah, like right about there. That's good for me. I'm gonna um, 
give a little exposure correction so it brightens up. That's good for me. Um, oh yeah, that should be good right there. Now we go over to effects. And uh, just gonna make sure that the exposure is good. I do like bright ass colors. I can't, I kinda, I kinda am a little oversaturated at times. Temperature, I'm more blue, definitely more blue on my temperature. Color cast a little bit red and go to effects. And uh, I want the sky to be really vibrant blue. There we go. So there's there's a nice vibrant blue. And then that's looking pretty good. Highlights. Um, I want the red because I'm in the shade. My my uh, car's in the shade, and it's a red car. I kind of want the red to be a little brighter. Okay, that did not do what we wanted. Let's back out of that. I think it might be um, might be highlight. All right, so we want red highlight. Oh, I know why. I know why, guys. Okay, because I need to back out of this. And uh, the mask was for the background and not the car. So we need to come down to the bottom. And it says car effects down here. And then now we can make the car a little redder. And uh, that's good. That's good. And a little bit more on the red. There we go, because it's in the shade. Highlight. What does what does highlight do? I don't know what highlight does. Let me let me just fuck around and find out. Oh, that makes it so glowing red. All right, we'll keep it right in about in the middle. Midpoint. What does midpoint do? Midpoint looks better lower. I'd say. All right, so adjust the midpoint, which is the border between highlights and shadows. All right, now we can uh, back out of this. Focus the camera. I'm gonna focus it on this uh, front right fender. And then we can take the picture. Let's see what we got, my boys. Dude, that LaFerrari is the king of the road, my guys. I'm telling you. King of the automobile world. You can zoom in. I'm getting a little blurriness on the wheel. Background looks good. And yes, 